Um, we we have a gynecology uh, led services in our in our uh, Apollo hospitals here, and we get a lot of patients uh, with hepatitis B infection during which got picked up during the antenatal. So as I said earlier, all these hepatitis gets picked up for you know tests for other reasons like like in pregnancy or for other other uh, master health check and stuff like. That. So when we when a when a, a pregnant lady comes to us with hepatitis. We assess the liver severity at that point and also the viral load. Okay, the risk of transmission from the mother to the baby is much higher during the delivery time. Okay, whether it's a normal delivery or whether it's a cesarean delivery, the risk is still the same. Now, when the baby is in the uterus, which is connected to the placenta, the baby is safe because this virus does not get transmitted through the placenta. Okay. So there's the, the transmission that happens is only during the delivery time, not during the pregnancy time. So if you uh, reduce the, if you have a very high viral load, uh, or a mother has got very high viral load, then we give medications in the last trimester of the pregnancy so that we reduce the risk of transmission to the baby. Okay? Because as I said, the, the virus does not get transmitted to the baby through the placenta. It is only during the delivery time, whether it is the normal natural vaginal delivery or to the cesarean. That's where when the blood to blood contact between the mother and the baby happens. And that's when the transmission happens. So if you actually give the mother viral load and reduce uh, the, uh, the uh, antivirals or the medications, reduce the viral load, then risk of transmission is going to be very minimal. Absolutely. And also, sorry, another important point is the baby, what we uh, give immediately after delivery is the, there are certain injections called immunoglobulins. Immunoglobulins are like the soldiers of the body, which protect us from the infection. So we actually arm the baby with the immunoglobulins so that they can fight the infection out very quickly before the vaccination starts kicking. 